All right, we got this book going into the pressing system. We have X-Men number one. So we got a couple of these actually. Um, both of them we're gonna try for a pre-screen to get 9.8 because this X-Men number one, there are millions of copies out there. So it's definitely not worth it unless it's 9.8. I don't think. So I will say that, <clears throat> you know, I think for any comic collector, <clears throat> excuse me, even though there were a million of these printed, or actually more than that, millions of these printed, I think everyone, they should have this book in their collection. If they don't, you're missing something because this was, you know, a very important era or time in comic collecting where they were printing a million comics So you can see this is a possible 9.8 candidate. So we're definitely going to clean press this and send this to CGC for a pre-screen. So I hope, hope you can join me and stay tuned for the rest of this video. We'll see the post pressing and we'll see if it got a 9.8 or not. All right, thanks. All right, we have this book that came out of the pressing system. So X-Men number one. Probably this was number three million off the presses. So saying that, that it has to be 9.8. So we're going to send this in for a pre-screen. So, so far it's looking great. This is the X-Men number one, the Storm Beast one, I believe. That's how people refer to it, I think. Now let's check out the back. So it's looking good. Looks really clean. That bottom is okay. That would still be a 9.8, I think. So I think the problem with this book was, it still has a little bit, you can see like the little bit of waviness, I guess, like this way. Can you see that? But no dimples, nothing on the back or the front. So I think this has got to be a 9.8. So I hope so. We're going to send it for a pre-screen. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts. Uh, let's check out the results. All right, we got X-Men number one back from CGC pre-screen. This is almost uh, got a 9.8 with white pages. Super happy about this. So again, I really appreciate you joining me for this journey. And hopefully you'll come back for another journey soon. Thank you.